Let's have a look at our Race 1 highlights for the Maguire's Australian Production Car Series. This is Race 1 of 4 for the weekend, and it was on the outside, Ian Sharon, who got the better of the start from Dean Campbell on the inside. The two championship protagonists taking it up mountain straight for the first time. There was a bit of push and shove. We saw them two or three wide going through their first corner of their first lap. Across the top of the mountain, we had our first real issue for the 85. Yeah, he parked up just on the other side of Skyline. And unfortunately, that was deemed to be a dangerous position. We had another one on fire, and that was the 98. That actually caused the longest stoppage, because they had to get that fire under control before they could restart the race. The one-shot wonder there with his little uh, fire extinguisher from inside the car, he actually managed to get it done and protect the car before the cavalry arrived. It was a long safety car period, though. And with five minutes re remaining, we got underway. Dean Campbell with a textbook restart showed a clean pair of heels to Ian Sharon straight up mountain straight and he was off to the races and behind him you saw the battles raging with Chris Lillis and uh, Holt Sutton Callahan who was in a huge battle with Pacini and then right towards the end Hodges mounted a big challenge on Ian Sharon wasn't able to get the job done but Dean Campbell 5.5 seconds up the road from Ian Sharon and was a very happy driver to take home that win. And then of course across the line in second was Ian Sharon, so keeping himself in title contention. And this one going backwards and going viral, no doubt. Crossing the line in reverse. Have we seen that before? Not in my time. That is a moment to savor. I think he went to swing it around and went, you know what, I'm so close to the line, I may as well reverse over it. And that is how he finished that race. And in the end, Jimmy Mantufel finished in position number 11.